Welcome to Red Dead 2 and thank you for joining us. Today we're going to learn how to craft the perfect ram shotgun coat. And to do it, we're going to need a couple of things. No luck First off, we're going to need BC two in, huh? ram pelts, perfect Extreme. ones of course, and 45 bucks. Now you're probably sitting there wondering, where do I find two perfect ram hides? Well, we're, we are right here, and fortunately, we were able to track down two perfect ram hides in this area right over here. The first one that we were able to catch was in Katora Springs, right there, while the second one that we were able to catch was a little bit uh, east of Fort Wallace, and we happened to catch it in that region right there. The next question many of you are going to have is what weapon do I use? And for me, the answer to that question is the Springfield Rifle. I've had very good luck with it. Now what you're going to be looking for specifically is this thing called a Rocky Mountain uh, Bighorn Sheep. And you want one, of course, with uh, three stars to start with. And you're going to need a real good clean shot. Uh, to keep it perfect. So we are going to go up to this Rocky Mountain Bighorn Sheep and keep our fingers crossed that it's a perfect hide. Uh, once again, the shots uh, that you need to get, uh, activate Deadeye with R3 for pushing that in, and then try to aim high toward the hide. Look for a, a spot to tag with R1. And of course, if you don't get the tag right, you can always untag it by uh, releasing the L2 button. And uh, yeah, just shoot with R2 there. It takes a little bit of practice, but once you get it down, uh, it can be very fun getting these uh, perfect hides. There we have one to stow on our horse. You may also want to save your game, of course, just in case something weird happens and you have to do, do it all over again. And of course, speaking of doing it over again, we are going to take a look at example number two that uh, I was referring to earlier. Now, as we are galloping across the bridge to nowhere, one of the important things you want to do is make sure your Deadeye core is maintained. So when you get that opportunity to hunt something, you can actually get a good shot off and, you know, get that perfect pelt. Because once, once you see something with three stars, you're not going to have a huge window in which uh, to take care of it. Here we are, we're wandering around, we're wandering around, and then all of a sudden... Oh, there's one right there! Oh, nice. Okay, let's activate the Deadeye. Alright, here we go, here we go. Tracking, tracking. Uh, let's see, try again. Okay, got him. No, no, maybe, maybe. Here we are, working it in there. Alright, let's see if we can get a good shot. Get a good shot. No, no, not quite. Alright, working down here. There we go. All right, let's take a look and see if we got uh, three stars there. And we do. Sweet. Now all we need to do is go to the trapper. And, of course, I would highly recommend saving your game just in case something weird happens. Because you never know in this game. You never know. All right, now that we are at the trapper... Now, I'm assuming you've already sold the two pelts, so we are going to go ahead and buy the item we're looking for here. We're going under uh, garment sets and then we're going to scroll all the way down here and uh, we've got this one right here called the Mountain Man and we're going to uh, select Ram Shotgun Coat. It's uh, 45 bucks and all you'll have to do is hit X to craft it and there you have it. You now own a Ram shotgun coat. You can equip it whenever you want, of course. And, of course, that is going to uh, wrap this up. Hopefully this was of some help to you. As always, I am signing out. Thank you for watching, and uh, good luck.